With energy efficiency more important than ever, we need to look no further than the remarkable example of our home, planet Earth. Its natural systems have evolved to manage energy with incredible precision and balance. I'm British astronaut Tim Peake, and I spent over six months aboard the International Space Station, 400 kilometers above Earth. From orbit, I witnessed the Earth's incredible natural cycles, perfect examples of how to shift, adapt, and balance energy. Join me to discover the secrets of planet Earth's energy, where E.ON Next challenges us to rethink our energy use, inspired by nature's example. As an astronaut, I am one of a handful of privileged humans to have seen the outer boundary of our planet, a veil that protects all life on Earth. From orbit, it appears as a thin blue line that encircles our planet, so delicate, yet so important. This is our atmosphere, a transparent shield protecting us from harmful solar radiation. Acting as Earth's natural sunscreen, this layer maintains the conditions needed to sustain life. And it's so much more than just air. It's a dynamic system exchanging energy with land and ocean. Like all life on Earth, the atmosphere follows a consistent rhythm in tune with the shift from day into night, undergoing a daily cycle of heating, cooling, and cleansing that preserves the intricate structure required to support life. As the sun sets beyond the horizon, the Earth begins to cool. The night offers a period of relief from the sun's radiation, allowing the planet to release all the heat it absorbed during the day, almost like an exhale. During this phase, the atmosphere acts much like a valve, allowing some heat to escape, cooling the Earth's surface. This can create a phenomenon known as temperature inversion, where the air nearest the ground is much cooler than the air above it. This release of heat might seem wasteful, but it's not. It's a balance. It's Earth's passive cooling system, allowing it to maintain an energy equilibrium that keeps the climate suitable for life. To ensure just the right amount of heat is lost, the atmosphere has a secondary regulator. During the day, the sun's rays heat the ocean's surface, causing water to evaporate and form clouds. This interaction between ocean and atmosphere is a vital part of Earth's energy exchange. As the planet releases heat at night, these clouds play a crucial role in controlling how much energy escapes and how much is radiated back down. They act as Earth's thermal blankets, filtering just enough heat to preserve a balanced energy flow. As the temperature continues to fall, water vapor condenses. Where cooler air meets the chilled surface, moisture settles as dew. A layer of water coats the ground, injecting a vital resource back into ecosystems, enabling cooling and rehydration processes that help organisms endure the heat and activity of the coming day. It's all connected, a self-sustaining planetary system evolved to conserve and repurpose energy in support of life. As day returns and the sun rises, the atmosphere begins to shift again. Clouds take on a new role. They become umbrellas, reflecting light back into space and softening the sun's impact. They shield the Earth's surface from excessive heat, allowing just enough through to keep the climate in balance. This delicate energy exchange is constantly adjusted between land, ocean, and atmosphere to prevent the planet from overheating or freezing. It's a constant cycle of give and take, removing energy from one component and transferring it to another. Nothing is wasted, only repurposed. While not many have had the chance to see the atmosphere from space, there is a rare moment here on Earth when its presence reveals itself in spectacular form, an aurora. These iridescent lights are more than a dazzling display. They're a visible reminder of the powerful shield that surrounds and protects our planet. 
Seen from above or below, they offer a glimpse into the Earth's interconnectedness. No ecosystem can exist here in isolation, and neither can we. Humanity is a part of this system, and we can choose to live more in tune with our planet's natural rhythms. Just like the Earth, we can design homes that prioritize energy efficiency by using natural features that complement the environment. Effective shading, ventilation, and smart materials are all part of a passive approach that significantly reduces the energy needed for heating and cooling. Like our clouds, good insulation can trap heat inside our homes and reduce the need for more expensive and traditional heating sources during the colder months. But the main takeaway is adaptability. Just as our atmosphere constantly adjusts the energy reaching the Earth, we can mirror this system. Living in a way that responds to the climate, storing energy for when demand is greatest, living more in tune with our Earth. Eon Next is helping homes across the country shift energy use to off-peak times, when electricity is cheaper to use. See how following nature's example could lower your bills, give you more control, and move the nation towards a more sustainable grid. Discover innovative off-peak tariffs and easy energy-saving habits at eonnext.com.